And Cash providing some resistance defensively. And he forces the miss. Rebound, Harazmi, and one. And then you see the distribution. And here you see a steal. Clarence Daniels, a left-hand slam. Daniels showing he's more than an offensive player. And there was a time early in the season where it felt like Binghamton was a team of destiny that had a couple of back-to-back -back wins as Johnson knocks down a three. Tripped by Falco and a nutmeg pass from Petcash to get it ahead to him. Good defense from Brown, but the Euro step works well for Falco. It's a one-point game. Tenth block of the year for Daniels, and Matt Harazmi buries a three. Yeah, Derry, 1,001 career points now to be exact. White stuffs it in. Daniels tries a three, and he knocks it down. Johnson knocks it down. Oh, the bench love that one. Skip pass, and they'll find Johnson. He's hit from there before, and he does it again. Great ball reversal by the wild catcher which is now seven games away for UNH. Who's going to stop the runs? Nobody so far because Armand Harid hits another three-pointer. It's a 15-0 Bingham. Tries a three. Off the heel, but a rebound. Hinkson. Great rebound. That was Falco's first miss of the half. He makes this one. Brown to the basket. Kick out. Baker, three-point specialist. Hits it! Oh, what a shot from Jackson Baker. It's a one-point game. 64% gets it away to Pet Cash, almost a steal, and a wide-open Harid will lay it in for two and one. Down to Pet Cash, Horn sounds, and Binghamton finishes the game on a 22-10 run to pick up their sixth America East win of the season, and they leapfrog UNH in the standings.